No, 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 no going back, daddy. Come, we go. Come. Who's that? Who's that, Heidi? Come. Bye. Bye, Kaylan. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, I've decided I, I wasn't sure if I'm going to do this video today, but I've decided why not. So guys, I am at my in-laws. Ni Easter. I don't wanna shout because at an I feel like my sound the guy in So we are here with Kaylan Machi Machi with my son, but it's Easter Sunday. Happy Easter Sunday to you all. I love you guys so much. So to me Yeah, for Easter Sunday we are at Limuru with my son and um, his dad and a lot of family members so yeah i'm just going to show you guys some clips if i'll be able to pull up the uh, out the camera in donation not like everything but yeah just a few cl clips of how we celebrate just a few clips of how we celebrated the easter sunday so yeah stay tuned see you guys in the next clip as we just because um my lover Koko and a chinja, so I can't go there and also Kellen was asleep so he's just woken up giving him fruits and a cake. I'm just waiting for him a cake dogo and then I give him another thing. Um what else, what else? Any updates kuna pikwa, kuna chinjwa and yeah we are just chilling as we wait. I'm going to show you guys. Um Yeah. So stay tuned guys and thank you so much for my subscribers. I love you so much. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, comment and like this video. Sawa. Sawa. So guys at this point i went to see uh, the chickens and there were a lot look at that guys i'm going to show you guys a better view they are a lot so i don't know if they are called kenyaji or i'm not quite sure but they were a lot so that's me trying to give you guys a better picture of the chickens and none of any meaning yeah so kilan alika amenda to go um to go bond with his uncle and uh, yeah so i was just left alone in this i decided why not so I... kilan's reaction to seeing chickens Kaylan's reaction? Happy Easter! So this was Easter Monday. So yeah, I went home and we were um, making some burgers. So my mom was making burgers for us. So she was making the meat from scratch. And these are the ingredients that you need. As you guys can see in the screen, I'm sure known all the ingredients. So we're going to start by prepping the meat uh, with um, onions, garlic, and ginger, of course, for spices. My mom really doesn't... Um, love the burger meat and a lot of spices but you guys can add any spice you want for us we only used uh, onions and uh, ginger and garlic so she, she grated as you guys can see i can grate and then now yeah to just prep the meat yeah so we'll go to the next step after she's done with that
okay guys so at this point we are done we're gonna add our lemon as you guys can see to add um taste i guess need to add to like taste yeah so that is a uh, lemon make sure you don't put the lemon seeds because it afanya the meat um so bitter so that is what we're doing and also some salt for taste um yeah so and then after that we're gonna need 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 yeah so that we can mix everything together that everything together um uh, will marry yeah <laughs> that is the word yeah so that is what she's doing she's needing needing kabisa to mix everything every piece of the um minced meat at least when i like the garlic and and ginger and everything nice yeah so after that we're gonna ship as you guys can see she's shaping shaping um them into balls and then now we're gonna turn them into parties parties how many parties whatever so yeah so she's shaping them yeah so this um meat was um Miss Sweet was 400 and we it made a uh, six burger parties. So yeah. So just in case mtataka kujua, yeah. So and then that was the cheese. Of course, and cheese is so expensive, but anyway, that was the cheese. It came um zikwa 10 dani and also two extra. So we're gonna cover it with cling film and then to take it fridge to sit for about 10 minutes as you guys can see. Yeah, so that it can be able to test up all vizuri. We are using Prestige, the best margarine, and to start me yoku fry the patties. So that is my mom shaping them. She's using that glass. No sasa is shaping the vizuri. Yeah, just for equal to nice and round. Yeah. So you can use either margarine or you can use butter. We didn't have butter, so we substituted with margarine. So to take up but um bagapati zetu and then we're gonna put it in low heat sour, low heat kabisa, so that itaiva pole pole and then itaiva vizuri ndani so that we cannot get uncooked burger parties yeah so that is what she's doing and azieka and then the good thing with this pan it was big enough so uh, as the six uh burger parties delito she has zote vizuri so yeah so we were able to just fry them at once instead of frying one one so it was all at once and that was the good part we saved a lot of time so i can get some in kidogo because it was a bit um it wasn't like it wasn't enough yes yeah, so that's that our burger parties are ready as you guys can see they were so well cooked inside and out i love the fact that they were crispy outside and inside they look so nice and flavorful so you are so that is how they were looking and also don't forget you must roast your burger buns those are a nice crunch in the inside and a nice like soft um feeling in the outside so yes yeah, so that is what my mom is doing there at a roast um the the buns with the same margarine
hi guys welcome back to yet another video sorry for the bad um lighting seen a ring light honestly and i have to really get a ring light i'm really really trying to invest in a ring light very soon because i want to give you guys good quality um videos even at night i don't want to limit myself um in the daytime only i want to do videos even at night but guys as you can as you guys can see i am alone i am not with Kaylan, and i figured out let me just do a sit down as i fold Kaylan's clothes i know i don't even i'll be able to do that to multitask because me mean like i just prefer doing one thing and i'm not going to the next but see me sana nime for easy nguo leo zilikuwa before i end so i've just washed them today and so that is why i'm folding his clothes so kelan is not here i took we went for i believe you guys have seen that video by now we went for easter at my in-laws place and also at our home so it was easter sunday at my in-laws and then easter monday at home so i left kelan there and let me tell you guys i needed a break urgently urgently nilikuwa nahitaji break and i know uh, this talk this topic is very sensitive i believe that unonanga like when you take let me just start by saying every mom needs a break even this uh content big content creators you see influencers they do take a break unapata wanaenda staycation wanaenda vacation with just um without their kids because they have someone to leave behind with their kids to take care of them but wewe mwenye una hata house manager unataka uweke ukaina mtoto a whole year the same routine the same routine na kwamba utachizi same routine you wake up you give the baby porridge you wake up you wake up you wake up and let me tell you ukijipe hiyo break kidogo utakuja kuniambia hapa kwa comment section utasema eh yenyewe a break is really really nice so that your mind unajua can nasema aje yani ujipetu your break kidogo and then even if it's a week a weekend and then you go take your child and you come back and you also have the energy unajua the energy to, to take good care of your child and so nilikuwa napata even um Uh, when i started um doing this breaks maybe take kela in one week when i have kuna job yenye inahitaji like a lot cuz i nikipata job na fai kwenda every day i take him for like a month and unapata one of a uh, incident i experienced and i think i never talked about it is that maybe kuna time ngine i i texted a friend nikamwambia oh mimi napeleka kela napeleka kela uh, kwetu home just so that i can have a break kidogo and then i'll uh, i'll go get him and ojo vinya liniambia ati oh eh me i have a bond with my child me i me i can't unaelewa so i feel like um other moms or uh, your friends can really make you feel guilty about it maybe by saying some unajua some statements and as a some statement mtu unazambia mtu napeleka mtoto wangu one week nda muendea just because i have to do one two three but unapata mtu anakuambia oh mbona unampeleka kwani ai nini nini like unajua so they it's kind of like ni kama guilt tree kama kufanya feel vibaya and let me tell you guys it is not bad as long as you cannot afford a um, house manager because na mean wala watu nyoko na house managers you can get out kama ni your break unataka unaweza toka uende kwa mall you spend the day alone or you go for a staycation somewhere in the styles ulale siku mbili tatu you come back home and you're okay asiti when you tuna house manager tutafanya nini itabidi you have to do what you have to do you have to take your child somewhere if it's um somewhere you trust tunajua the people you trust uambie nishike kila one week i have to do this and this and also just take a break i'll come back for him and you know your child will be comfortable so there is no reason to feel guilty or to feel bad about it it is okay it is okay acha nikwambie shida routine moja from january to december the same routine aki you cannot 
you need someone to help you and even as they grow they will become more independent na hiyo ndio time yenye utakuwa enjoy but for now senye they need to unajua unafai kuwafanyia hii na hii you don't have to kill yourself honestly you don't have kujiweka a lot of pressure unajua you you just have to take at your break a one week a weekend and you will be good to go so for me i decided to take this break and i believe all moms need uh breaks and it's okay if you have a house manager then well and good that is the that is good house manager mpoa you ni poa unaenda wapi 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 useme leo natoka sika kwa nyumba ama leo unajua kujipatia hiyo break but for us when you bado hatujabariki <laughs> na house managers we we do what we have to do but anyway um i also wanted to take a, talk about my consistency guys I know most of the times I come here and I see I'll come back um ntarudi stapotea tena I'll come back and do YouTube and believe me guys it really affects me I'm, I really feel bad that I don't post like I used to I remember when Kila used to be a child akwa mdogo kabisa tuko kwa bed sitter I used to post three times a day Yeah I used to post on Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday always. Na kuna time nyingine nilikuwa nimeshika mita na post singekosa ku post. And I know and I saw the growth in my channel you guys. I saw the growth and I loved the growth. And let me tell you guys I really want to go back to it. And I know sometimes I come here and tell you guys I want to go back to it. I want to go back to it and maybe I don't but believe me guys I'm not si same yet nakuja tu kwa pair hopes and then i don't do it it really affects me and i really feel bad and i really try as much as possible ndo maana nakwambia kailan akikuwa hapa as in the only time unapata leo niko na um kila nameamka i give him what i'm supposed to give him i take care of him he sleeps but once he sleeps guys niko na kazi i have to wash his clothes i have to wash the utensils as i was saying I have to wash the utensils zenye ametumia. I have a lot to do. And you unapata kila na 30 minutes peke yake. Most anaweza lala ni 1 hour. And by the time he wakes up, I'm done with work, but I haven't recorded anything. And that is why I really need a, uh, a stand because nilikuwa nafanya hizo kazi, I can literally put my phone there and record myself. Even kama siongei nitafanya baadaye voice over, but I can record myself. And that is one thing I really need to get. So inakuwa very hard. Kila nakuwa mdogo he used to sleep. Yeah, so mnajua baby sleep a lot. So nilikuwa napata a lot of time to do my content. But sahi Kailan analala kiasi sana. So unapata ile utikiasi nyanalala I'm doing house chores. Unaona? So inakuwa so hard. At the end of the day nimechoka sija record anything and it really really uh, affects um me and i feel bad when i'm not posting because me i love i love content creation and i know the potential i have honestly and i know i can be the biggest content creator in kenya mimi najua i know saim nazona eh quality i know i know i have that potential and it's something i really love it's something i do with a lot of passion unacho ni record video i feel so nice the only but i don't feel um good about is editing miss me to edit honestly speaking and i don't think if there's a lot of people who love editing but miss me to edit but just recording video and posting content and, and just posting content and putting my videos out there it really really makes me feel good nikiwala nime post video leo i feel so content i feel like i've done something with my life today mnaona ushaiambiwa bango twende on this day i was craving kfc and i told my lover kanemba bango twende kfc so we are headed out to KFC and uh that was my feet uh, I really loved how it looked yeah so my top is from my daddy wears also my loves outfit and shoes are from my daddy wears so in case you don't know my love sells shoes and also I'm a and I sell pair my t-shirt so if you really want uneza DM my daddy wears so we were going to deliver I was taking him to deliver and that can just super after delivering the shoes to a client so we just got to get um soda because soda gives me the 
so you can get that if you got spoonie i got a uh, coca cola yeah and that was us uh, at this time we went to kfc yeah so we went to i was so excited i was so excited honestly speaking <laughs>